Hi there, I'm Zoran Demerovic and I'm from Berkai. <laughs> this poem contains references to homosexuality and suicide and is called The Big Fight. <clears throat> 6 p.m., he's, he's in the hallway looking down the, in the mirror, wondering why. Why did he take the, pill, the whole bottle of pills when the doctor only prescribed one a day? 7 o'clock. His body, the numerous, out, the numerous outlook, the numbness outlooked the body, and he passes out. He falls to the ground. His mom comes home, freaking. His mom comes home, sees him laying in the, laying in the hallway. Nine fifteen. He's in the. He wakes up with IV shoved in his veins and sees the tubes coming out of his stomach as he as they are pumping out the. Leftover pills. He is forced to drink wet charcoal <laughs> to clear out what already absorbed in his bloodstreams. The paramedics ask him why. 7:42 a.m. The jocks in the school push him around in the lockers 200 times a day. And at 10 p.m. 10 a.m they get ready for the swirlies in the bathroom. The same bathroom that had the blood on the floor from the, attempt, from the recent attempt, suicide attempt. March 12, 20, March 12, 2020, 2014, the day he finally decided to come and have the courage to come out and tell, free his soul and tell his mother that he is not who he decided, that he is not who she wanted him to be. After growing up, hearing all the things that he, she said about how homosexuals deserve to rot in hell, and those words disturbed him, hurt him, and terrified him. Holding him, there was a big boulder holding him back from telling his mother the truth of who he really was. He went and found a girlfriend to appease his mother and her expectations and dreaded the day that she would accuse him of being a disappointment to because of her, of her choices. Until that one day, the boulder shattered. 5 a.m., knowing his mother's reaction, he decided to meet her in a public area to tell her, to soften the... <laughs> to soften the blow, he, he had a secret to tell. And two words came out of his mother as she stared at him in silence. I'm gay. And the awkward silent, she screamed out at the top of her lungs, you homosexual, go kill yourself. The horrifying words could be heard through the drive-thru. 6.15, he took the full 30 pills. He's laying on the floor. His mom comes home, she's freaking out. She calls the paramedics. 9.15, he wakes up, what, he was confused. Not as confused when people think that homosexuals are confused, but because he was confused that his mother tried to save him when really she wanted him dead. He was confused why he saved her. I mean, she saved him. Thinking why, why are these emotions playing with my mind? I just wanna be free. I mean, he just wants to be free. How many of you have swallowed a full bottle of pills when the doctor only prescribed one a day? How many of you have woken up with IV shoved in your veins and, and tubes coming out of your stomach as they are pumping out the leftover pills? How many of you have ever been confused? I have.